You quickly learn as a parent that your job is to try and steer and guide, but ultimately to support your children's choices and decisions, whether you agree with them or not. While this is not always an easy task, by any parent, we live in constant hope that our children will continue to make good choices and good decisions. Now, Glenn has made his fair share of questionable choices and dodgy decisions. But they've all worked out well in the end, and we're incredibly proud of the young man that Glenn has become. But surely his greatest achievement is what we're all here for today. And we look forward to seeing what Glenn and Emma will achieve in the future life together. Glenn, as you know, I don't make decisions very easily, but standing here today, about to marry you, is the easiest decision I will ever make. I love your cheeky heart and the confidence you have to life. Thank you for always challenging me and for bringing out the best version of myself. I love that when I am wrong, you always let me know and can make me laugh at myself, just right now. Um, I promise to continue to let you think you're right, even when you're not. And I promise I will try not to turn off the TV in the last five minutes of a TV show. I love you for all that you are and all that you aren't. I promise to always be on Team Glenn, be by your side. Thank you for showing me what love really is. I can't wait to be your wife. Emma, I thought nothing could be harder than flirting over Bumble until I went to write these vows. So here we go. It didn't take me long to know that one day we would be right here getting married. You drew me in with your contagious smile, your caring eyes, and I immediately loved your sense of fun and kindness. I'm so proud of what we have already achieved together and how we have grown. Life with you is going to be so full. Full of kindness, laughter, travel, wine, family, and love. I love how easily we fit together and how you make me a better person. Thank you for keeping me in the moment and being my fierce supporter and cheerleader. I love how much you care and how you make me feel like I am the only one that matters. I love the way we joke and mock each other and the way we never take things too seriously. Thank you for being you. Showing my adoration and love for you is now my lifelong privilege. I love you and I can't wait for our life together. It gives me great pleasure to pronounce and be husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. I think you can all agree with me when I say it's a beautiful day. Emma, the way you look tonight is simply stunning. And Glenn, I hope you're feeling good about how you look too. We're all looking forward to the dancing at the end of the night and we can watch you sway to and fro. But Glenn, just remember to save the last dance for me. Glenn, you bring out a side in Emma that I only used to see when it was just the two of us. You make her laugh like no one else can. You've brought out her most authentic self and the love you share is proof that the right person can really enrich your life. But when we met Glenn, you can see they just, they're, they're well matched. And next minute, I look across and Emma was just a little smile on her face. Glenn had his hand on Emma's knee. After that time, I thought, no, this is going to go somewhere. Sheila and I could not be happier in welcoming Mrs Emma Langridge to our family. We're proud of Glenn and Emma, both as individuals and as a couple, and we look forward to being a part of their future life together. 
I wish them all the best. I know they're going to have a great time on their honeymoon and a great time in their journey through life. Here's to a future filled with love, laughter and countless new memories together. If everyone can please raise their glass to Emma and Glenn. The lovely couple to Glenn and Emma. Mr and Mrs Langridge everybody, give them a round of applause.